Something big is coming, and it's smaller than you think. DJI's next generation ultralight drone, the NEO 2, has just leaked in full detail. And this time, it's not speculation. Multiple industry insiders are confirming the launch window, the new hardware upgrades, and even the pricing structure. If you thought the original DJI NEO was impressive, the NEO 2 is about to change everything in the sub 250 gram category. For months, the drone community has been waiting in silence. Rumors came and went, fake renders floated around forums, and there was no official word. But now, multiple sources, including a leaked teaser from Quadro News, point to a launch as early as October 30th, 2025. DJI already released the Osmo Mobile 8 in China earlier this month, and all signs indicate the Neo 2 is next in line, just days away from pre-orders. The Neo 2 keeps its ultra-light classification still comfortably under 250 grams, meaning no registration hassles in most countries. Leaked images show redesigned dual-layer propeller guards, engineered not just for safety, but for airflow optimization. But what really changes the game? Omnidirectional obstacle sensors. Unlike the first generation, which offered limited detection, the NEO 2 features front-facing and angled sensors that monitor multiple directions at once. Some insiders speculated it could be infrared LiDAR, but the most credible sources say it's a hybrid optical infrared system built for agility, not industrial mapping. Flip the drone around, and you'll see a revamped antenna system. Analysts believe this is O4 digital transmission, the same technology found in DJI's higher tier drones. What that means is simple, extended range, near zero latency, and rock solid connection even when flying FPV with goggles. Now let's talk about the most exciting part, the camera system. Leaked specifications list a 1 slash 1.3 inch CMOS sensor, positioned between the front sensors and supported by a new two axis gimbal system. This combination promises remarkably smooth footage without adding extra bulk. Rumors suggest 4K at 60 frames per second, 10 bit HDR and up to 13.5 stops of dynamic range. Numbers that compete directly with drones twice its size. For creators, this means real professional imaging in a drone that weighs less than most smartphones. Flight time and performance. Powering the Neo 2 is a 1,600 milliamp hours battery, offering around 19 minutes of flight time. Not the longest in the DJI lineup, but respectable considering its weight class. Wind resistance reportedly reaches level five meaning the drone should hold strong in breezy outdoor conditions while still hitting top speeds of 16 meters per second with a control range of up to 10 kilometers. Smart features include gesture and voice control, automatic return to home, acro mode for freestyle flying, six quick shot cinematic presets. This isn't just a toy, it's a creative tool designed to be easy for beginners and powerful enough for experienced users. Storage and pricing. Internal storage sits at 22 gigabytes, with no micro SD slot, likely a move to keep weight and complexity low. It's a controversial decision, but familiar for users of the original Neo. According to leaked pricing, fly solo, $229, drone plus one battery. Creator combo, $299, adds controller plus extra battery. FPV starter bundle, $399, Goggles plus Motion 3, Controller plus 3 batteries. Fly More Kit, $449, Full FPV Bundle plus Carrying Case, Hub, and Spare Props. DJI is clearly positioning the Neo 2 as the ultimate entry point into serious aerial filmmaking, without the barrier of a $1,000 flagship drone. So what does all this mean? The DJI Neo 2 isn't just a minor upgrade, it's a statement. DJI is doubling down on the mini drone market, bringing features once exclusive to high-end models into a beginner-friendly form factor. With a powerful sensor, FPV-ready transmission, advanced safety systems, and a launch date just around the corner, this could be DJI's most impactful mini drone since the Mini 2 SE. If these leaks are accurate, the Neo 2 could redefine what's possible under 250 grams. The only question left is, are you ready to fly it? Let me know in the comments. If you found this breakdown helpful, hit like, subscribe, and hit the bell.